Hi friends, we're going to be doing page 70, Comparing Instruments. Page 70 of Building Opinion Writing, uh, Comparing Instruments. Okay, so the direction says complete the chart. Okay, so if you look down here, there is actually a chart. And so I'm just going to outline it so you can see when they say a chart. This is what they mean. Okay. Okay. So this is what they're talking about. And it says only drums, only piano, and both drums and piano. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and read this together here. Okay. First, we're going to read it and then we're going to decide which category it these should go into so drums says this is drums and this is piano drums ha is percussion instrument a piano is a percussion instrument the drums are many sizes and a piano is many sizes drums are played with fingers or drumsticks the piano is played with fingers on keys. So that's a little bit different. It has stretched skin drum head, has hammers inside. So that's definitely two things that are different. Is simple, was the first instrument, has thousands of parts. Okay, so the, the last two you can tell are different, right? Okay, so the drums only has the percussion instrument. It's a, I'm sorry, drums and piano both have. Let's do that again. They both have. They're a percussion instrument. They both have, down here, both drums and piano. They both are many sizes. Okay. And only the drums are played with fingers or drumsticks, has stretched skin on a drum head, and is simple. It was the first instrument. That's only the drum. And only the piano is played with fingers on keys and has hammers inside and has thousands of parts. And that's only the piano. Okay. This is only the drum. Okay, so now we need to write it. Now when you see this, it's called a colon. There's two um, dots. That means they want us to list uh, items. They want us to list. And when we list, we use commas. Okay? So we're only talking about the drums. And we have three things right here. Okay? So we're going to start it off by saying only drums um, let's see oops I messed up so I should say R sorry about that R played with fingers or drum sticks comma has stretched skin 
oops, sorry, drum head, comma, and, okay, if you can't fit it on, instead of writing real sloppy and squished, I want you to find some paper, and, like, this was my other paper the other day, I wrote, it was on page 69, I'm just going to draw a line, and I'm going to put page 70, right here, and I'm going to keep going. I'm going to also write um, drums right there. Okay. So I had said only drums are played with fingers or drumsticks, comma, has stretched skin drum head, comma, and I'm going to go back to the words up here. I'm going to write is simple was the first instrument, okay, is simple was the first instrument, period. Okay, now I'm going to go back to where it says piano, and I need to do the same thing. I'm going to, it says only piano, okay? So, only piano, only pianos are... Played are played with fingers on keys, comma, fingers on keys, comma, has has hammers. Okay, now I have to go, and, and in fact, I might even put an arrow to show Mrs. Langlet that we need to go to the next page. Has hammers. Okay, and then this is piano. Inside. Comma, and... Oh, you can't see that, sorry. And has thousands of parts, period. Okay? Okay, and then the very last part is both of them together, both drums and piano. Okay, and they both have, they're both percussion instruments and have many sizes. Okay, so down here I'm going to write both, oh, my pen's running out. Both drums and Piano are percussion percussion instruments and many sizes, period. Okay. All right. Let's see. 
I just want to show you what I'll be looking for in this one. Okay, I'm going to be looking for a capital letter. I'm going to be looking for, here's a capital letter. I'm going to be looking for commas and the word and because we're listing three things. Um, let's see. Comma and. And then I'm looking for a period at the end. Okay. I'll be looking for capital letter B, the word and, and a period. Okay. Nice job, friends. Now remember to, to write your words, your letters, inside the two lines. It's extremely important to practice, okay? I know you can do it. Kiss your brain. Nice job.